How's it going guys? It's Expert Greatness here from IXO Gaming again. And today I have your gameplay of Gotham City Imposters. So um a few of you guys have been making some suggestions lately on my commentary, which is great, which is great. It helps me out a lot. So thanks for the feedback on that, everybody. You probably know who you are because I probably thank you in a comment or a PM. But anyways guys, so the only reason I haven't shown one of the newer maps in se like that wasn't on the beta because one is because I always get gameplays on this map because I love this map. As you can see, I'm just I start off this game um, messing around and then I see Steven get like six kills in the kill feed and I'm like, okay, okay, I can't let this happen. I can't let Steven outclass me because this was actually the first match we played together. Because if you guys have seen um, all my or a few of my past one of my past videos, I. I let you guys know that he has been having internet problems and so he wasn't able to download this game for a while. But he got it um, last weekend and we played it. And so that was a lot of cool fun. And um, and he loves it and he's just a beast. And you'll guys see that in his gameplay. He totally outclasses me. Here I just get pwned. But um, yeah, he's he's a beast at this game. So um, I'll let you guys know when he starts posting videos. He's going to. He's also part of IXO Gaming, but he just hasn't got his PVR yet. And we're working on that but I'm sure that'll be coming soon so that's one cool thing to look forward to guys um I'm using this gun again this this submachine gun because I love it it's got if you guys are wondering this is the ivy camo I believe it's called and it's one of the first ones that you unlock for it and it's pretty cool looking so I was rocking that out and then I got this fully automatic shotgun as my secondary um but but um guys I ha it's not that I have not been liking this game or anything like that it's that um one night I just got into a lobby of really good players and I was just doing garbage and it just like it made me realize that this game is possible to not have fun on and it's not it's not a bad thing I mean obviously every game you're gonna have times when you play it and you get frustrated like I just didn't know I just didn't think I could on this game for some reason but I mean it happens whatever um I still have a lot of fun playing it um and I still I'm gonna play it a lot and you know that's all gravy but, um, but I don't think it's going to be my main game, and I don't think that, um, I don't know, I just, like, it's a good game, and I hope they make another one and stuff, but I don't think it's going to revolutionize the first-person shooter. To be honest, that's just how I feel about it. Let me know how you guys feel about it, but, um, all I do like a lot of the things in this game, like the Christmas stuff and all the giggles and the, the voices, the voiceovers are great, all that stuff, and it's... It's just a really good game for 15 bucks, but um, to be honest, it, it hasn't been my main game lately, and I thought it would be for a while because I am I have been getting frustrated with Call of Duty, which is my main game that I play. But um, but actually they came out with if you guys don't know if you I I know some of you guys don't really play Call of Duty I, I'm guessing and um, they came out with this new playlist called Infected, and it, it's been a private match game mode, but I never really played it. But it's actually pretty fun because it's like 18 people, so it's a pretty big lobby, and it's it's really cool. And like me and my friends have just been playing it and having a lot of fun. Like not even caring. Like I don't even care about my stats anymore, and like I actually I never really cared about them. And um and I've just been playing this game mode, and it's just a lot of fun. Oh, by the way, if you're wondering why I'm moving so fast right here, I believe I'm using the rollerblades, which are pretty good. You move fast, but they also can like screw up your aim and stuff, so it's kind of a balance. If you know what I mean. Look at this guy. Get this camera up here. But anyways, I've been having a lot of fun with that playlist. It's a lot of fun to screw around in. Because, like, yesterday me and my friends were just having competitions. And, like, if you guys don't know in Call of Duty, if you press YY, you kind of look like you're dead. So if you get, um, if you just, like, lay down next to a dead body, I don't know. It looks like you're dead and stuff. And, like, it's just so funny watching, like, 12 infected guys walk right past you. And just, you're, like, just, like, laying down in the middle of a floor. It's so awesome. But <laughs> it's just funny. Um... But so yeah, that's what I've been doing a lot of that this weekend. Let me know. Let me know if you guys want to see a video of that because I actually haven't been recording it because it's I'm just playing that game up for fun. And I honestly I don't really watch a lot of infected gameplays because like to me getting a mo like I got a mob in infected ones, but I was like man, this doesn't even feel like anything. Like I still think I I don't even count it as like a real moab because it's it's a lot easier and it just is kind of not the same, you know. But um. Let me know if you guys want to see it because it's it's pretty fun to play and I don't know it's it's just it's just a cool thing that I like to do and also the matches are like really fast which I like because you can just play for an hour and get like you know play like 12 15 matches and it's like it's 
pretty awesome. But, um, yeah, that's one thing about this game. A few of the games, like, game modes are, like, really long. Like, uh, what's it called? Psyche Warfare. But, like, a lot of times games like, um, Fumigation are really short and stuff. And I personally, I don't know why. Maybe it's because I just am not good at it, but, or I haven't been good at it yet. I don't really like Fumigation in this game, even though Domination Call of Duty is my favorite game mode in this game it's basically the same thing um just called different you know um and i don't know i just don't like it i don't know why um but my favorite game mode in this game is just basically been team deathmatch because then i don't have to worry about an director i can just screw around and in call of duty it's like the opposite like i want to be i don't know it's just a different mentality i have when i play these two different games if you guys understand that you know um yeah guys this is um it's kind of a dull moment in gaming, in my opinion, because cause it's like, at least to me, like, um, every year in between, like, the Call of Duties, when the, f when the Call of Duty, that the newest Call of Duty has started to get boring, but the other one is still pretty far away, it's like, it's really dull. I, it's not in gaming, that's a bad way to put it. I said it's a dull moment in gaming. It's not a dull moment in gaming, because there's a lot of games, like, big games, like Skyrim and Battlefield and... Arkham City and all these games that people are still loving and enjoying and it was a great year for games to be honest It was a really great year But um But yeah for Call of Duty guys I don't know it's it's kind of like it's this is not I actually like Modern Warfare 3 most than or more than most Call of Duties um That's I know I'm pretty alone on that but I I do and um there are frustrating things But um But it's not like you're walking and you're getting new to every two seconds um, and that's really the worst thing in any Call of Duty, in my opinion, to me, was Modern Warfare 2. But, um, but, like, anyways, back to my point. I just get off topic on these so bad, but, um, it's kind of a dull moment for Call of Duty, guys, I, in my opinion, because, because the Modern Warfare 3 is kind of nearing the end of its life cycle, in my opinion. I don't think it's gonna be, um, like, obviously it's gonna be a, a more played game and stuff, but it's not gonna be, like, as, um, enjoyed and as wanted to play and as um entertaining to watch the videos of it and stuff and it's just it's kind of at a dull period in my opinion um but i'm sure around november next year everybody will be psyched for black ops 2 except for the people that are you know there'll probably be a few more people that are like man call of duty puts out the same thing year after year and it always sucks and yada yada but you know what, <laughs> if I knew Modern Warfare 3 was going to be really fun for 2-3 months, and I was going to love it a lot, and then after that I was going to absolutely hate it, I would probably still buy it. Um, and that's just me, you know? Um, but I guess I guess that's how I view it. Um, if I'm paying $60 to get 10 days of game time or something like that, ridiculous, then I think it's worth it. Um, because I paid $60 for Skyrim, and Skyrim's a great game. But, um, but I haven't got nearly 10 days in that. I maybe have, maybe have two. Um, and I'm kind of bored of that game already. And I haven't even gotten close to beating the campaign or anything. But, um, but yeah, that's just how I feel about it, guys. This video is coming to an end. I did decent in this game, but nothing like Steven. Steven beasted it up, guys. So, um, you guys will see him dancing in the end. I'll leave you guys. Goodbye. Peace. See ya.